Hey fans, it's Trigger King RCTV, the 2024 Summer Series, event number four. This is bracket number eight of the season, bracket two of the day, with only three brackets in the summer season remaining. We're getting down to it, and it's retro action. Taking a look at the qualifying results, you see King of the Grove, Bigfoot 4, and Barefoot Racer leading the charge in the low seven second range on this J hook or U shaped track, if you will. Starting off, and we'll head straight over a tabletop in round number one. It's Big Boss, number 16, and Mile High Crusher, Troy Haas, the number 17. Long straightaway into a tight checkup. The trucks will have to hit the brakes and hit the right speed over the bus stop and Cheech Agash gets it done in Big Boss. Thunder Chicken, Chris Lane, number 15 and number 18, Gunslinger, Fred Kors. Kors in trouble so far, Thunder Chicken off to the lead, Gunslinger charging, wow! That got tight right at the finish line as we spin back to take a look at the TKRC replay. Thunder Chicken all out of shape, Gunslinger cock locked and ready to rock right at the finish line. I think you see it by a little more than a tire tread. Gunslinger Fred Kors gets it done with a late charge. Taurus, Jeremy, Mark, and no problem. Dan Cheech Agosh. Oh, no problem. Stuffs it into the bus stop as Taurus gets all the way to the finish line, no problem. Cheech, a lot of action in the first round as we move into round number two, and Cheech made it through the first round, and his reward is the fast qualifier, barefoot racer Chris Parrish. Drivers ready? Yeah. Watch the light. Both trucks, neck and neck. Barefoot a little bit better around the corner. Upset over the cars. And Barefoot Racer gets it done. Not a pretty race for either truck. Bigfoot 7, Bob C. Chandler. And Orangeinator, Chris Blank. Blank, tight corner and puts Bigfoot 7 on the trailer. Chandler right back up on the line in Monster Orange 4, number 13 qualifier, and Bigfoot 1, Chris Hackinson, the number 4 qualifier. Hackinson pulling the wheelie off the starting line. Monster Orange in trouble. Hackinson looking good, and Bigfoot 1. Number five qualifier, Master of Disaster, Chris Parrish, and Iron Aaron Janes in King Ghidorah, the number 12 qualifier. Oh, Ghidorah walking it on the tail, but not gonna get it done as Master of Disaster puts him in his place. Gunslinger, Fred Kors, a great race in round number one, but now he gets Josh Rhodes, Bigfoot four, Sitting second in the points and showing why as Bigfoot 4 racks up in more points. Barefoot, Chris Hackinson in the far lane and Jeremy Mark, Buffalo Trimmer in the near lane. Hackinson looking good. Oh, both trucks heading towards the center. And Barefoot gets it done. Taking down Buffalo Trimmer. King of the Grove, the number three qualifier with the six wheel semi in the far lane. And the number 14 qualifier, Taurus 2, Jeremy Mark. The six wheeler has an impressive advantage just being able to pile drive the obstacles and there he gets it done again. Incredible, the six-wheeler just keeps making rounds in event number four. Overkill and Gravedigger, Spurlock versus Rhodes. Oh, 
I thought Gravedigger was giving up a bit in the corner as Spurlock charged hard, but nothing doing. Gravedigger gets another one. Cruising through the bracket, round number three already as Barefoot Racer, the fast qualifier, faces off against number nine, Orangeinator, Chris Blank. These car sets on the final straightaway proving to be an interesting challenge as it can throw the trucks left and right. So got to keep the truck under control. Barefoot does that and moves to the semifinals. The other Mean Duck Racing truck on the starting line. Master of Disaster pulling hard to the left off the starting line. All kinds of trouble and Bigfoot one, Chris Hackinson moves on. Bigfoot four, Josh Rhodes, number two qualifier against the other Barefoot. Barefoot by Chris Hackinson, representing the red Dodge throwback. Oh, Rhodes in trouble, but Hackinson with more trouble. Rhodes recovers and Bigfoot four will join the semifinalists. Our final round three pair, King of the Grove and Grave Digger. Oh, you see the advantage right there for King of the Grove. No wheelie over the bus stop. And King of the Grove sitting on top, moving to the semifinals. Barefoot Racer, the fast qualifier is still in the bracket. Number four, Chris Hackinson. Barefoot off to the lead. Cautious over the first set of cars and flying over the second. Barefoot Racer moves to the finals as the number one qualifier. We had a one, two, three, four semifinals. This is the two, three matchup. Bigfoot four, Josh Rhodes, and King of the Grove, Chris Blank. Rhodes kept Bigfoot 4 close to the ground, but nothing doing as the King rises to the top and moves to the finals. Incredibly, King of the Grove, the six-wheel monster truck from Chris Blank, is in the finals as the number three qualifier facing off against Barefoot Racer Chris Parrish, the number one qualifier. Barefoot with a big leap, but out of shape down the front straight away and the king is on top incredible to see a six wheel clod buster take the victory but this truck is simply incredible pile driving through the obstacles and he's gotten this thing to turn big trouble for barefoot in the far lane but the king of the grove looking great all day long and getting it done in bracket two action. It's a day of incredible things. We just saw the six wheeler win, but we've got a four way tie for the overall. This leads to a qualifying pass for each truck and then we run a four truck bracket. The winner takes the overall and the points for the day. We ran through qualifying and we've got King of the Grove and Bigfoot four. Rhodes, all kinds of trouble. I think the big orange six wheeler might be getting into some competitors heads as King of the Grove heads to the final finals. And in the other matchup, Barefoot Racer and Bigfoot Seven. Oh, Barefoot hung up on the turn marker. That's all it'll take for Bigfoot Seven to come back and steal the victory. That sets it up. This is for the trophy and the points. King of the Grove and Bigfoot Seven, Chris Blank versus Bob C. Chandler. Chandler with a big wheelie over the bus stop. He's behind the eight ball, and he's buried in the grove. The king reigns supreme. Chris Blank and king of the grove takes his first overall victory with the massive monster six-wheeler.
That'll move him up in the point standings to number four. We've got Bigfoot 7, Bigfoot 4, Barefoot Racer on the podium right now. Fairly neck and neck. We've got more action in our season finale coming up soon. Event 5, be on the lookout. We'll have lots of great action and we'll crown a champion. We appreciate you joining us as always. We'll catch you next time.